Now I'm be saying, me, Yoruba, let me, if I go market, now I know if you price something, they go say, no be your brother, they rule. No be your brother, they rule. See me spy, where are they say, 15 naira before. See me spy now. How much they sell now? 200. Me spy, don't reach 200. 200, if I go say, no, no, no. this me spy, don't there, they go say flower. Now it's something thousand, now they buy. Who's your robot, they send me to give Nigeria? I send message to Tinubu, say at the first, because I did been. Come on for here, no be your brother's swear line like this, no be your brother, they rule Nigeria. A mean binu si bitinu bu tori be o go shata and she on jela finche a rowo fi pama u de ye ko ribe. Thank you very much. Thank you. God bless you, madam. Oh go to de o gwe na yi ya gwe bi. Oh ti de o o gwe bi denti ti o. Retirement age in Nigeria civil working ages around 60 something years. Why should our president be over 80s? It's not easy. They should not just take decisions rashly. It will land on citizens in Nigeria. We are the ones suffering. It's like we are working as slaves in our own country. Even in our bank, cybercrime is against us. They just deduct our money anyhow. I believe Nigerians should hold fast, strong. We should drag this protest as long as we can until whatever we demand guess given to us yeah i've never watched anything more annoying like this video now watch ambada jaran bohol bohol haguda ishirin da da akan kudi ne ra billion da da million da biyu now that is the governor of sokoto state aliyu ahmed so he said if you don't understand how so let me interpret He's saying that um, they budgeted and they repaired 25 boreholes with 1.2 billion naira. Now, we have 999 million, we have another um, 100 million and 200 million in 1.2 billion. And he said they used that to repair 25 boreholes. Do you understand? See, Nigerian youth, it's now time for you. Leave this Tinubu. This Tinubu, Tinubu, where everybody they talk. You don't they make all these state governors don't know. Say, okay, yes, if these people are putting blame on Tinubu, then we can easily do anything. Nothing touches these state governors. It's time to leave Tinubu. Tinubu don't drop the money. Do you understand? Did Tinubu not give them money? Where did he get this 1.2 billion from? It is from the budgets that they gave to his own state. Do you understand? How would you tell your state people that you use 1.2 billion naira to repair? 25 boreholes. I don't do borehole for one uh, for one uh, community for a learning. How much did I spend? Do you understand? As I'm talking to you now, I have budget for some boreholes I want to do for some states. How much did I spend? I spent almost five million naira, right? So that money that that man is talking about, so can give or take, he can do like 500, 500 million boreholes. Do you understand? Now, all of us, the Nigerian youth, we need to stop doing what our forefathers did, whether we point and holy to the presidents. Do you understand? You point out only to the president is wrong. All these state governments, all these state governors, they are getting, they are getting it easy. 
It's time to protest. You see, if you want to even do protest again, it's time to stand against your own governors in your state to say, why is our road not good? If this man is saying he's using 1.2 billion naira to repair 25 boroughs, imagine how much he will collect to repair roads. I watch this thing with so much disgust in my heart, with so much anger in my heart, because, yes, it's not my state, but it is crazy. Let's stop this bandwagon of eh, every time Tinubu, every time Tinubu, did Tinubu not give these people money? You heard it now? Am I crazy? These are the people putting country inside inside a mess. Time don't reach every soon. I will come on for this Tinubu nonsense. Do you understand? It's time to forget all this Tinubu. Focus on your state governors. My road is not good in those states. Do you understand? From Edo to Wari, from Edo to Delta State is not supposed to be give or take. It's not even supposed to be up to 30 minutes. But you go use four hours, three hours till they go till they go Delta State. Whose fault is that? Don't say a federal road, federal road. You as a state governor, don't you want your state to be good? I will come and say but Tinubu, which Tinubu again? Now, before, yes, me self, I like to insult Tinubu. It is my right to insult Tinubu. But there are some things that I sat down and I calculated and I said, no. No. Your state is bad. There's no road in your state. Tell your governor. Protest against your own governor first. You don't have good schools. Protest against your state governors first. Don't let them go out easily. We blame Buari for in time. But there were governors that their name did not come out. Buhari regime was bad, but the governor's name did not come out. We blame good luck, but the governor's name did not come out. Now we don't start this thing with Tinubu, and our forefathers did the same thing again, blaming the number one man, but forgetting that this number one man also have people that they picked, and those people too are not doing anything. How many things you want the number one man to oversee? How many things? Nigerian youth wake up and understand that wait, the governors of our states are the president of our state. They are the president. We should hold them accountable for nonsense. I am not from Sokoto, but this is annoying. 1.2 billion to repair 25 balls. Give me that money. You know how many balls I will do for Nigeria? 1.2 billion is crazy. See, leave Tinubu out of this. Do you understand? I don't like Tinubu. Do you understand? But please, let's sit down and think. Face your state governors. They are hoeing you. This condition we put ourselves for this problem. When Ibori day, Ibori a useless governor, Ibori a thief, then we take our own and send Ibori go shake. Ibori na don't come, don't come back by the grace of God. Now, they say, join Jonathan regime. Bag of rice was 7,000 naira for bag of rice. But today, basket of rice is 8,000. We say, but you say, we are not uh, uh, Jonathan, not good. Jonathan, a woman. Jonathan, a thief. Jonathan, a woman. Why would they worry when we don't see man? Where they take us? Where they, where they don't put us like this? Man will not worry now. Now man will not get now. The woman don't come out. The, the man, the real man don't come in. <laughs> when you see man, other men will step aside. Mm. Let the, make the man rule eight years. I don't get problem with that one. No. Because now we put ourselves on this problem. Now we put ourselves on this problem. We got it. They are going to buy 500,000 and again, they are going to talk about again. The, the kidnappers and the S-men, they should try to remove them from those bush. Let's government find solution to that one. But by the grace of God, Nigeria will be okay. By the grace of God, Nigeria will be okay. No need for one to die. Nobody won't die again. Answers just now, we lose prominent Nigeria. We lose better boys so if we go call roof for a future. We lose those ones. We no one lose anybody again. We are appeal now to our president. Make it hear our cry, make it calm down. People must talk from different places. You must hear different talk. As a leader, you must hear different talk. There's as a leader, you must lead. Uh, with a, you live with example. example. Yes. So make them try, hear yeah, our cry. I bet we don't want fight. We don't want protest. We want peace. Hello, Nigerians. My name is Timothy Abiodo Olatukumbo Chubiele. I followed the demonstrations. Some turned riotous. Some of the demonstrators were arrested. I learned they are now being charged for treason. 
I have to be honest, I am yet to see the church sheet. But I had a top functionary of the present government address the world that demonstrators tried to overthrow the government of the land and that they should wait for a change, wait for the next elections. I had on, t on, on a video a top lawyer, I think he's acting for the government. He said that demonstrators are being sponsored by foreign interests. I believe these demonstrators are being tried for treason just to deter other Nigerians from demonstrating. Demonstrators claimed that they were demonstrating against hunger in the land, which is real to many Nigerians. They claim that they were demonstrating against bad governance. When and how can demonstration against bad governance and hunger in the land turn to treason? I am pleading with the Honorable Attorney General, Chief Latif Fagbimi. I have never met Chief Latif Fagbimi in person. I've seen him at a distance in a party. But I've never met him in person. I was told that he was called to the Nigerian bar in 1985. In 1985, I was a junior lecturer at the Nigerian Law School, Victoria Island. I can't remember Chief Latif Fagbimi as my student. But I can remember some of my students who were his mates. I remember Honorable Ogala, Baba Tunde Ogala, FAN. He was my student. I remember Chief Femi Fanikayode. He was my student. I taught Chief Femi Fanikayode Nigerian legal system. I taught lawyers who trained in foreign university. I remember Niyi Owolade, former Deputy Speaker, Oshun State House of Assembly, former Minister, uh, Commissioner for Health, Oshun State, former Attorney General, Oshun State. I remember Bola Ladna, the daughter of the law legend, Harry Ladna, who is now the Managing Director of one of the foremost banks in Nigeria. Ruth Banam, no, there's this other lady, two of them studied abroad, they were newscasters on TV. Mm, that's been, that's, that's almost 40 years ago, I've forgotten their names. So, Chief Latif Agbemi, I was called to the bar in 1980, I'm your senior at the bar, I am pleading with you. As your senior, I am pleading with you as your teacher. Please, if it is true, I will be happy if you deny all that I have said. Withdraw these charges. Demonstration is not treason. Don't keep these children. Don't keep them in the cell. They'll probably be there for another two, three, four, five months, even one year, because all you want to achieve, this government wants to achieve, is to deter demonstration. Then after some time, the charges will be withdrawn. Show mercy. You are a, you are a member of a honorable society. Don't play the wheel of politicians. You did not get to the office as, a, as a, any other politician. 
you are a lawyer indeed. I plead with you. Then what is the solution? Some people have said they want to go on demonstrations again. First of October, please.